It's the same day. Same day, different video. You, you read the title, look. Look, y'all. You read the title, so you know what I'm about to talk about in this video. Um, for those that don't know, and before you call me a bandwagon, all that, look. Yes, I am a Patriot fan. I've been a Patriot fan all my life, so don't come for me. You know what I'm saying? Simple. I'm going to be talking about, in this video, the game tomorrow against the Packers. Um, I know y'all about to be like, wow, this is the first time this man talked about football on this channel. Yep, you're right. I actually have a few um, trash-ass gaming videos that I posted on this channel a while ago when I first started this channel. Also, that's crazy. This channel was also, this channel when I first started was actually a gaming channel, but it, I got tired of, you know what I'm saying, posting god dang gaming channels on, I mean on gaming videos on this channel, because, you know what I'm saying, audio purposes, the games didn't have audio, and I didn't really, you know what I'm saying, feel like always posting gaming videos on this channel. Um, I'll probably just make a third channel. Just focusing on playing video games because I like to I like the game too, you know what I'm saying off camera. But that's I said off camera. Wow, that's crazy. But anyways, man. So yeah, today I will be talking about you know what I'm saying the game against the Packers, Patriots, Packers, Sunday night football. Um, look, I'm gonna say it. I'm really excited to see to see this game. Um, now the Patriots are six and two. We did just play the goddamn trash ass Bills. <laughs> oh shocker! You know what I'm saying? We beat them. The game the game was um a little bit closer than I expected in the first half. I don't know. I don't know who the Bills thought they was. You know what I'm saying? For for a start there, they looked like they had a defense. They, they looked like they had a defense the first half. I was like, oh, when, oh, this Buffalo? This what happened when they play on primetime for the first time in like seven years. Because I don't know who in they right mind. Like the commentators was over here talking about people came here for Buffalo. Boy, you're playing the Patriots. Like what, what person in they right mind going to say, hey, I'm going go to go to a Buffalo Bills game? Boy, I don't even know any Buffalo Bills fans. Like, look at the team they played this week. Oh, the the game is sold out. Yeah, I wonder why. You know what I'm saying? It's not because of Buffalo. It's because you played the Patriots. Let's just be honest here. Now, looking forward to Sunday. Um, you know what I'm saying? Obviously, playing the Packers. Yeah, they got Aaron Rodgers. I don't hate Aaron Rodgers. The thing is, I don't get. And here's the thing that pisses me off with Packer fans and the Packers in general. I don't get the debate between Aaron Rodgers and Tom Brady and how Aaron Rodgers is supposedly better than, than Tom Brady. I don't get it. You know, a dude, I mean, you can look at the stats. And people just want to make up random stats that make Aaron Rodgers look better than Tom Brady, even when he isn't. You can look up real stats and see the numbers. You know what I'm saying? Tom Brady is, yeah, better than Aaron Rodgers. Talent, talent-wise, Aaron, you can say Aaron Rodgers is good. Cool. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Oh, what? Aaron Rodgers can can run faster. Aaron Rodgers can throw off a back foot. Okay. Oh. Speaking speaking of being able to run, Tom Brady almost only needs three yards to, to get to a thousand. You know what I'm saying? Simple. Only took him 19 years, but whatever. Cool. You know what I'm saying? That's okay. F fine with fine with me. We only need three yards to run. Go, go ahead and get it. You know what I'm saying? Simple. That's three quarterback sneaks. 
That's three quarterback sneaks and um, some checkdowns in the backfield. You know what I'm saying? Just run some trick plays for Tom Brady and give him three yards. Cool. You know what I'm saying? Simple. Fine. So, so Aaron Rodgers is more talented. All right, fine. Our offense is more explosive. You know what I'm saying? I like our chances on Sunday. I'm going to say it. Um, yes, the Packers are a good team. I'm not taking nothing away from the Packers. I'm also, don't don't get me wrong, I ain't taking nothing away from Aaron Rodgers. Aaron Rodgers is a good quarterback. He cool. You know what I'm saying? The dude is good in the fourth quarter. All right, cool. You lost to the Rams. How, how, how are the Rams playing this good? You know what I'm saying? I don't get it. Yes, I do get it. They got damn well are the Warriors of football at this point. Look like it, right? Till it get to playoff time, and then they lose in the first round. Because I'm gonna be honest, I don't got the Rams winning the football. Winning, I said the football. Winning the Super Bowl. And maybe that's just me being a biased uh, Patriot fan, but I'm gonna say it. I don't think they're gonna win. I got the Patriots winning the Super Bowl this year, because you know what I'm saying I'm a Patriot fan, so I got to roll with my team, regardless of how. You know what I'm saying? We started the season this year a little shaky. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? Niggas always want to talk about, um, wow, you, you, you guys are one and two? Like, all right. And we finished October on a five-game win streak. But but now everyone don't want to talk about nothing, huh? When y'all was... When y'all five weeks ago, y'all was talking about, oh, the Patriots, the Patriots dynasty is over. Oh, Tom Brady, Tom Brady done lost it. So we go on a five-game win streak. Where y'all at now? You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't heard a Patriot hater talk since, since September. And we shouldn't even have lost some of them games. You know what I'm saying? Hell, we should have only one loss at this, at this point. You know what I'm saying? I don't see how we lost to god dang Detroit. Um, so anyways, you know what I'm saying? I like the Packers. Packers are cool. They're a good team. But when I when I look at the two sides of the football, offensively, I got the Patriots winning. You know what I'm saying? We got Gronkowski. We got a better tight end, obviously. Our receiving court. Look, we got Josh Gordon. We got Julian Edelman. We got Chris Hogan. We got got dang Dwayne Allen. Dwayne Allen is, you know what I'm saying? Dwayne Allen to me, I'm gonna say it. The the dude, the dude is just there to be there. You know what I'm saying? Whenever Gronkowski doesn't play, because he's hurt. You know what I'm saying? So. Obviously, it's going to be a game time decision probably tomorrow or something. Um, which, obviously, we've been dealing with a whole lot of injuries, too. You know what I'm saying? We lost to the Jaguars because of injuries. And now look at the Jaguars. You know what I'm saying? Jaguars are trash all of a sudden. Nick, niggas beat us. Niggas beat us. What, what was it? A couple weeks ago. You know what I'm saying? Started talking shit. I think it was week three. Started talking shit. Like, Jalen Ramsey ain't talked since week three. Niggas got exposed by the Cowboys. What have the Cowboys done all season? Nothing. You know what I'm saying? Trash. Um, so, when I look at the offense, I got us winning. You know what I'm saying? Offense is cool. Defense to the side? Uh, it's, it's questionable. You know what I'm saying? I think we, I think we got areas to improve in. I don't like how it was the trade the trade deadline had approached, right? And I was like, okay, let's see if we let's see if we can make some moves, see if we can trade trade for some people or something. You know what I'm saying? Cause I see if I see some I see some superstar talent up there, there's some free agents. You know what I'm saying? We don't really need any like offensive weapons. We cool on that. You know what I'm saying? We got Josh Gordon. Cool. You know what I'm saying? I just wanted a good receiver. And they, maybe we're just too spoiled of a franchise, of fan base uh, when it comes to winning all the time. I, I'm sorry. You know what I'm saying? Why do, why do people always hate on the Patriots for winning so much? 
oh, I'm sorry, we want to be good every year. You know what I'm saying? I'm sorry, we're not. We're not good with being mediocre. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what, you don't want your team to win a championship? <laughs> okay, fine. Cool. You know what I'm saying? Um, but the trade deadline gets gets here. We don't do nothing. All right. You know what I'm saying? We play the Packers this week. We only got so much days of rest. Then we got to play Sunday um, against the Packers. So it's like, all right, let's see if the Packers actually do something. The Packers, they got rid of Ha Ha Clinton Dix for whatever reason. I don't know why they got rid of Ha Ha Clinton Dix. I think they got rid of Ty Montgomery, the nigga that was respons responsible for fumbling and losing that game against the Rams. That's a that's questionable. T that was a questionable decision to just take the ball out when you got Aaron Rodgers, who's one of the best quarterbacks in the fourth quarter, with like one minute that can just take you down the field to score a touchdown. Because I mean, the Rams to me right now, I mean, as good as they are, there's the. The last couple weeks, they should have lost. I'm gonna be real, like, like yeah, they, they what eight, eight no, nine no. They played the Saints this week. I'm gonna say it. In the last couple weeks, those games they all should have been losses. I swear to God, wow, that's crazy. that um but yeah you know what I'm saying so defensive wise I'm gonna say it. Gilmore has been doing great for us this season which I wasn't really sold on him last year I was I was actually uh, um, I was actually hating on Gilmore last last season I'm gonna say it before the playoffs like before he made that play against the Giant Bars I was actually hating on that nigga because I felt like he wasn't living up to the hype. Um, and that's cool. You know what I'm saying? People people think Josh Gordon lost it. Like, he got here a couple weeks ago and he has a hamstring injury. What do you want from him? Like, y'all expected this man to, to just come to this team with a hamstring injury and go off for like 10 touchdowns every game. Like, damn. The nigga got a hamstring injury. What do you want from him? That's like Gronkowski. The dude got a bad back. I mean, yeah, Gronkowski ain't scored since week one. You know what I'm saying? That's a, that's a long time ago. You know what I'm saying? It's week nine now almost. Dude, score. Just score a touchdown. You know what I'm saying? Against the, against the Bills, I was like, all right, this should be easy. You know what I'm saying? Blow out. Halftime was nine to... What was it, 12-6 or 9-6? What the fuck going on here? It's, it's, goddamn, it's the Bills. You know what I'm saying? God knows what the halftime score is going to be against the Packers tomorrow. If we can play. So I'm going to say this before I end this, as I end this video. I'm going to say this. I have us winning. You know what I'm saying? I have the Patriots winning. Um, I'm going to say this. If our defense shows up, and for some reason, you know what I'm saying? So if our defense shows up, I have us winning. Because obviously, defensive side, you know what I'm saying? When it comes to playing defense, obviously, it comes down to just playing defense. Because you never want to give Aaron Rodgers time. Simple. You get, and it's, it's vice versa with the Packers, you know what I'm saying? If you give Tom Brady too much time, then we carve up your defense. So I guess it comes down tomorrow to just defense. You know what I'm saying? Because it's two special, special quarterbacks um, that are obviously very good at what they do. Um, yeah, Packer fans always talk about, oh, well, if you put, if you put Aaron Rodgers on the, on the Patriots, you know what I'm saying? Then do it. You know what I'm saying? Do it, and we'll see what happens. Please, please do give us Aaron Rodgers. I'll be happy. I don't know how how Packer fans will live with that. But hey, you know what I'm saying? We'll we'll ever so glad gladly take him off y'all hands. Um, but yeah, 
I think I think it all comes down to who plays the best defense. You know what I'm saying? So if our defense can play ever so fantastic, that'd be amazing. You know what I'm saying? We get out of here this week being I want to say seven and two, um, and then we play I think the Titans next week. We play good old Malcolm Butler and Deion Lewis, and you know what I'm saying the reunion of the ever so many goddamn New England Patriot players that ever that just so randomly want to all play for the Titans. You know what I'm saying the the Tennessee Patriots. I swear, like goddamn, how many goddamn Patriot? How many former former Patriots are on that team? Deion Lewis, Logan Ryan, Malcolm Butler. It all started with Logan Ryan, and then I think Mike Rabel. Is Mike Rabel the coach? Because I know Mike Rabel is the coach. I forgot who he coaches. But I think it is Mike Rabel. I'm pretty sure I'm correct when I say Mike Rabel is the coach. Um, like, damn, who is y'all? The goddamn Tennessee Patriots? You know what I'm saying? They also play on Monday against the Cowboys. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to watch that game. About to cheer on for, um, about, to, about to just put on. You know what I'm saying? Okay, cool. You know what I'm saying? Okay. But, yeah, man. Look, Packers are losing tomorrow. I'm just saying. I got confidence enough in my team and, and the Patriots to say that we should win. And we should um, head into Tennessee 7-2. Um, you know what I'm saying? It's a big game for us. I don't think we have enough um, besides the Steelers. And possibly the Vikings. I think we only have two other tough games to play this this year. Um, Record-wise, I think we're finishing at most 13 and three. So I think if we lose tomorrow, then we should finish 13 and three overall. You know what I'm saying? Which is cool. You know what I'm saying? I think we finished 13 and three what last year, or 14 and two, or something like that. That's all right. Cool. And then we go to the playoffs and we, you know, we run the goddamn table on everyone in that, in that goddamn AFC playoff picture. The, the goddamn Kansas City Chiefs want to be good. Niggas want to hype them up like they don't do this every single year. Niggas, niggas started undefeated last year and everyone was hyping them up, talking about, oh, they about to make the playoffs. And then they lost in the first round to the goddamn uh, the Titans. Niggas, niggas lost to Marcus Mariota. <laughs> it's trash. It's terrible. You know what I'm saying? Niggas lost to Delaney Walker and Marcus Mariota. Like, Marcus Mariota actually had a touchdown. You know what I'm saying? Terrible. It's trash. Um, so, yeah, Patriots were winning tomorrow. I don't care. That's my prediction. Comment down below. Let me know y'all um, week. What are we in? Week nine predictions? Yeah, week nine predictions. Let me know y'all got winning this game. I'm taking the Patriots. Simple. That's the end of this video. I know it's long. I don't care. Like this video if you like this video by smashing the like button. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Also, if you don't know my name, my name is Justin Sawyer. Um, so, yeah. But if you aren't new here you probably already knew that so you know what I'm saying simple turn on post notifications as well so you never miss a video on this channel and I will see y'all possibly to, yeah tomorrow with a new video I'm not even gonna say possibly I'm gonna just post a video tomorrow peace yeah, that's a whole lot of hand gestures I fucking hate, I fucking hate mosquitoes. I'm gonna say it. Mosquitoes make me sick. I got about fucking one. I got like five mosquito bites. That's fucking trash. That is terrible. Damn, turn.